This year, Pride events will not be held in a traditional way, but the Navajo Nation is also considering enacting some new legislation. It's an eight Pride Week throughout the Navajo Nation. The Navajo Nation Council speaker signed a proclamation recognizing its LGBTQ community. This year's festivities will be different. The Navajo Nation has been devastated by some of the highest rates of COVID-19 in the entire country. Our plan for this year completely um, was derailed because of this new time and our, our, our shared experience with COVID-19. So instead of community gatherings like last year's festivities, Diné Pride is holding virtual events and a socially distant parade. And although um, we're all going to be separated by our vehicles and we're following um, the guidelines set by the Navajo government, um, it's also going to be an awesome, awesome time to show the visibility of the community. Because it's a sovereign nation, U.S. Supreme Court rulings on marriage equality and employment discrimination don't apply. The Navajo Nation has a ban on same-sex marriage. Because right now, if you're on Navajo land, rather you're a contractor, rather you're a visitor, a tourist, or rather if you work for the Navajo government, there's no laws here that protect you on the basis of your gender identity, your gender expression, or your sexual orientation. These little bends and arcs in history that we come to portray has helped to move generations of hope. But the speaker of the Navajo Nation Council this year promised to look at changing that. Danae Pride says the council will consider new legislation to support LGBTQ rights. It's time for us to open up an opportunity to have further discussions and making sure that every single person on the nation has an opportunity with their partner, with their significant other, to have a home site lease, and do respect and have ceremonies blessed and welcome to them. Now that legislation is expected to be introduced and considered later this summer. In Salt Lake City, Ben Winslow, Fox 13 News, Utah.